Good morning, day 21. That marks three weeks on trail today. Um, we are slack packing today. We, so I told you last night, we got off trail. We went to, was it called Creekside Retreat? Creekside Paradise. Creekside on the AT. Paradise on the AT. Wonderful BMB. Is it Jeff and Cynthia? Maybe. I'll figure out the names. I know it's Jeff and maybe Cynthia, but they took us in for the night. We were the only hikers there, hung out in the hot tub, had a wonderful breakfast this morning. Their place is so cute. 10 out of 10 would recommend staying there. So we are slack packing today from Yellow Creek Gap or something like that, or Yellow Gap. And then we're going to go all the way up to the start of the Smokies and then we'll get picked up. Tomorrow we're gonna zero, so I'll show you what a zero day is like <laughs> at a B and B, which I guess is not really typical for through hikers, but we'll we'll have some fun and then uh, we'll get back out on Friday, starting right at the Smokies at the dam, so it'll work out real nicely. So show you what we get into today and let's get hiking so this is where we were gonna stay last night this is our 15 mile goal and uh as you can see, there's not much tent space. I think we made a good choice. <laughs> this is our first view, I think, of Fontana Lake. Not sure, through the trees. Wow. Where is she? There she is. I spotted a wild Cheyenne, a wild spirit fingers in the woods, texting because she's a millennial, always on her phone texting. <laughs> so there's some sort of berry growing on this bush. There's just one, one more over there. Not quite sure what it is, but that's a good sign. <laughs> I'm not eating it. You're trying to kill me. Spirit fingers. Uh, yep. Homo Homosec Homosecatonin. Homo Gonna be there in two hours. Let's go. Our first sighting of the dam, Fontana Dam. Ah! <sighs> you know, when I first thought about hiking the AT in my purest self of gotta hike every inch, I didn't think that a uh, slack packing would be part of it. This is the second time I slack pack and I'm a big fan. What a cheat. <laughs> like I know I'm gonna get some haters out there that's like, you're not hiking the AT because you're not, you're car not you carrying your backpack the all the miles. And I'm here to say, I love slack packing. It's my favorite. Okay, I had to go over a branch. Um, but yeah, it just puts you in a better mood. It's not as painful on your joints, so it's like you're kind of resting, but also getting some miles in. Like I'm basically considering today a Nero, even though we're hiking like essentially eight miles. It's not really a Nero. So just wanted to throw that out there. If you're afraid you're gonna get made fun of, don't be because you will get made fun of but your knees won't hurt so Hi, let's go friday let's go
we made it to the Fontana Marina. We have a couple more miles to go. We are gonna get all the way to the dam today. We thought we only had six miles for a moment. And then Cheyenne miscalculated. <laughs> Last night we were like, oh, we have eight miles. And then today she's like, oh, we only have six. No, we actually have eight. <laughs> Just hung out at the marina for a little bit, got a free ice pop, and now we're headed to do the last two miles to get to the dam. Ooh, so pretty! So pretty. We've just been hiking along the outskirt of this lake or river, or I don't even know what it's, what it's called. I'm assuming lake. So, so pretty. The Fontana Hilton, supposedly the nicest shelter on the AT. Trash cans! Just up the hill a little bit. We got maybe the bathrooms and showers, not really sure. Just road walking. A road walking. Dang. You pretty. So that's cool. We won't do that until Friday. Okay, got a little sign here. Fontana Dam. Length 2,365 feet. Height 480 feet. Pretty cool. I'm all alone. There's no one here beside me as I eat my salad out of a bag. <laughs> But like that's usually the extent of what I'll put on this. But I usually I like the taste of the cheese on the inside. So if I put anything on it, I usually can't mm -hmm. taste what's on the inside. Gotcha. But regular pasta, I'll sometimes do like butter and garlic. I'll never eat regular pasta by itself. I always put something on it. Usually red sauce. But if I'm feeling really lazy, I put butter and garlic on it. Never tried that. Hot tub living. <laughs> 